எல்லாருக்கும் வணக்கம் மகாசிவராத்திரி வாழ்த்துகள் வெல்கம் டு மகாசிவராத்திரி ட்வெண்ட்டி ட்வெண்ட்டி ஃபோர் it's a it's our great privilege that we have our beloved vice president of india here with us and also honorable governors of tamil nadu tripura and punjab and many other dignitaries welcome to every one of you well This is the 30th Mahashivratri in Isha. Well, 30 years ago, in 1994, we… Uh, the Shivratri night, we have… we were little over 70 people and there was only one lady. I don't even know her name, she was over 75 years of age. They just called her Chennai party. She knew only two songs and she sang… Say, sang the same two songs throughout the night. But we were so crazy, blown away by Shiva. We danced, we meditated, we celebrated the entire night with just two songs and her throat was hoarse. But she went on singing, her devotion and dedication fired everybody up and it was a full night. And here we are after thirty years as probably the largest event on the planet in terms of… in terms of its reach both online and by television. As you all know, last year over 140 million people participated in the Mahashivratri event across the world. This year, people are estimating it could be over two hundred million. So to every one of you, To every one of you, millions of you, wherever you are, whichever part of the world you are, I know it odd times for many of you in different time zones, for every one of you I bow down and welcome you to this grace of the divine. This night, which is Shiva's night, the greatest night in the year in terms of an upsurge of energy, on this day, There is a natural upsurge of energy which human beings alone are privileged to make use of because we have a vertical spine. And above all, you are here at the Isha Yoga Center which is located on eleven degrees latitude. If you know the incline of the planet when it's rotating is such, at eleven degrees latitude it creates maximum centrifugal energy or upward movement the natural physical force. So everything is working in favor of you and there is Velangiri Hills. It's a cascade of grace. There is Adi Yogi, there is Yogeshwara Linga, there is Dhyana Linga and we are all here together wherever you are in the world, we are here together. So on this day, let this night not just be a night of wakefulness but a night of a weakening. It's your choice to make it this way. It's not just about staying awake, ensuring this becomes a night of awakening. Human possibilities are many. How many will we explore in this life is what makes us who we are. Of the millions of possibilities that a human being holds because for every other creature, nature has drawn two lines. For the human being, there is no top line. You can rise to become a Purushottama, that means a raised human being. So how raised you are will determine how wonderful your experience of life is. The wonderfulness of life is not determined by what we eat, what we wear, where we live, what is around us. How wonderful our life is determined by what's happening within us and this is a day where you have a special support from Mother Nature herself and Shiva's grace is in a cascade. It's my wish and my blessing, everyone should make use of this on this night 
and you're going to stay away with me. Hello? <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, till six in the morning. I request our honorable president or the vice president of India to say a few words. Vice president of India, Sri Dankarji, is an accomplished lawyer and, uh, and many other accolades are with him, but I won't take any time, this is his time. Easy to speak in your presence. <laughs> I'm behind you, sir. It's a mighty <laughs> tough job. I'm facing this moment for the first time in my life. <laughs> Never had Namaskaram. Never easy to speak after the great man. It's a challenge tougher than I faced in West Bengal. But his presence is inspirational motivational and energizing for me and you all. Reward Sadhguruji, the one and the only one of his kind on the planet. Thiru R.N. Raviji, Honorable Governor Tamil Nadu, Srimati Lakshmi Ravi, First Lady of Tamil Nadu, Sri Ann Indrasen Reddy Ji, Honorable Governor of Tripura, Srimati Renuka Reddy, First Lady of Tripura, distinguished audience present here in physical and also in virtual mode. I have made a mistake, blunder of my life. I have forgotten my wife, Dr. Sudesh Dankar. <laughs> I dare not do it in the presence of Sadhguruji. <laughs> he believes in sublimity of human values and basic rights. Friends, I am in face with divinity. This is a rare moment of my life, an absolute privilege and honor to be part of Mahashivtri celebrations at Isha Yoga Center. These celebrations are unique. These celebrations are unforgettable. This is a moment I will cherish all my life. My heartiest congratulations to all on Mahashivratri, festival of festivals, Mahashivratri is one of the largest and most significant among the sacred festivals of Bharat, home to one-sixth of humanity. Friends, this festival celebrates the grace of Shiv, who is considered the Adi Guru or the first group from whom the yogic tradition originates. As indicated by Sadhguruji, the planetary positions on this night, which is also the darkest night of the year, are such that there is powerful natural absurd of energy in the human system. I am feeling it. Are you feeling it? I'll carry this energy to be in service of Bharat Mata to the best of my capability. <laughs> Friends, I shall be ever grateful to Sadhguruji for making available this opportunity for me. 
and for my wife, Dr. Sudesh Dhankar. What a pleasant coincidence. This year, Mahashivratri coincides with the International Women's Day 2024. The theme this time is Invest in Women, Accelerate Progress, and friends, the campaign theme is Inspire Inclusion. All these are amply reflected in the initiatives and endeavors of Sadhguruji. Let me at the outset commend your endeavor, sir, in resolution.